All right, triple extension, your triple extension. You're gonna balance on one leg, it's very simple movement, it's all about balance, so oftentimes professions are just going to change it all up for your triple extension, changing up the environment into a foam roller or into a, a little bit more difficult would be a BOSU or a Dynamics, both of which are out. Triple extension, it's gonna extend those hips, you wanna keep a good tall vertical spine, you're only gonna get about 30 degrees of extension right there in the hips and your lateral extension, then you're gonna take it out in front, you're gonna get close to 30 to 45 degrees of extension out there in the hips, good tall spine, bring it on back, now this is the tricky one, your third movement will rotate on this leg. So you're going to rotate around, but still get a lateral hip extension. So it's gonna be like this, but then pivot on this side, all the way around, so you're opening up that belly button and bringing it back. So again, you'll be on the same leg the entire time, out to the side, pinch it tight, bringing it back at about this tempo. Your progression would be onto something a little bit more unstable. Now, we don't do a whole lot of unstable surface training. And the reason being is because it doesn't translate very well uh, according to current research. It doesn't translate very well out into the real world. However, it will build up ankle stability and it does have an uh, uh, effective use in knee uh, pain in, uh, individuals, and particularly those just overcoming knee surgery. So it's a, uh, a good physical therapist stolen move, right? Uh, however, it will be a good challenge and it's a good recovery. So oftentimes the goal is to go heavy whenever we add this stuff and it's only gonna be uh, just a little bit. We're gonna be focusing a little bit more on balance. Side, extension side. And the goal is to stay on that foot the entire time. Right? So again, from the side, out in front, out to the side, and then pivot and rotate around. Right? You do want a good soft knee uh, uh, on the leg that you're balancing on, particularly on the rotation, uh, to make sure we're not going to damage the ACL. It shouldn't because there's no uh, great impact. Uh, we're actually looking to strengthen up the knees. And that is why it is in our, our coursework here, our load, uh, to help build up knee stability. And it's paramount, paramount, paramount. 